Hi guys, Liz here. Happy Friday to you. Well, I was just sitting here on my phone and I was like, oh my gosh. And then I'm like, say it isn't so. And then I went, no, that has to be wrong. And then I, I looked again and I was like, oh my gosh, it is not September 21st. And then I'm like, yep, it is. Oh yeah, it is. Liz, it's time to step up your game and get your act together, girlfriend, and get these two hutches styled for fall before it's Christmas time and it's too late to do it. So that's what we're going to be working on today, styling my family room hutch for fall. Now, before we go into the family room, I have received numerous questions asking as to whether or not I'm going to be having a fall home tour. So to answer all of your questions, yes. I sure am and I am going to be working on it all this weekend and let's just say I don't want to let the cat out of the bag but it's going to be special and it's going to be we're going to have fun with it and I've got myself some new equipment y'all know I'm a rookie I wholeheartedly admit it but I'm amping up my game for this one guys I'm amping it up big so with that said once I start getting the footage rolling in and I start editing, I'll give you a better idea of when I'm going to put my fall tour out, fall home tour out. But um, I'm really looking forward to it, and um, I'm hoping you guys will really enjoy. All it. right, all right, enough of me talking. Let's go into the family room and let's go style that hutch because I got to get things ready for this fall home tour. It's got to look gorge, right? Gorgeous. Let's okay, go. Okay, guys. Here's. You know what? I've been calling this a hutch. It isn't a hutch. It's a bookcase. I think I didn't get enough sleep last night. Anyway, this is a bookcase. We're going to style it. I've already started with a mirror right there. I do want to point out that I already styled that the end of August. I know. Blush, blush, blush. I'm, I'm sorry to say that, but... That's when I start decorating is around the end of August. And if you like this look, all I did was use greenery as my base. Then I stuck in a whole bunch of fall floral picks, put a fern in the center of it behind and behind it to fill it in, and then strung some orange lights. So super easy, um, very festive. If you guys are movie buffs or you like to hang out in your family rooms at night and watch movies, there is nothing more cozy then having a fall tree lit up with your orange and amber lights and then your bookshelf um, toppers being lit up at night. It's just so cozy. I love it. So anyway, enough of that, but let's get styling, okay? Oh, let's start with this. So I got this pumpkin at Pier 1 Imports and I love it. And... When you go in pair one, they always have these little stands with it. So I think I'm going to put my pumpkin on a stand over here. And I love, love, love this greenery. So I think I'm going to place that over here. I like a little pe couple pieces hanging off the side there. So I have this cloche. I got this at Home Goods. $12.99. Can't beat the price. And all I did was add some moss and put a pumpkin on top. And it's got little cute little silver feet. So, And I like the basket weave pattern on it. I think I'm going to put this on the other side. And I'm going to put a little pumpkin next to it. Okay, now I know what we're going to do. Do you guys like sunflowers? If any of you are on the East Coast, Wegmans sells this plate. 
It was $24.99. Didn't like the price, but I had to have it because sunflowers are so cute and cheery. So I'm going to put this center stage on the middle shelf. Plate holder. Perfect for fall. Now, also at Wegmans, they had this, y'all know I love roosters and chickens. So I got this. This was part of that collection. This was $9.99. Again, I thought it was a little much, but when you see something you like and you love it that much, you get it. So this is going to go next to it. So I'm kind of turning that one a little catty corner and trying to think of what to put next to it. Hmm. I always like decorating with book boxes and I've got this so I may just sit this next to it. See how that looks. Sorry, guys. Amateur here. Um, now I've got this platter. Oh, I just thought of a cute idea. Love topiaries, love them. So I think I'm gonna put it over here. Actually. What do you guys think? Mmm. Needs height over here. I think I need a pumpkin. Let's see. I think that's cute. Now, let's style the next shelf. I have this fall platter, and so I think I'm going to use my plate holder and put that on the next shelf. Don't you hate it when these don't work out? Sometimes you have to bend them. I hope this works. Let's see. I've got another one of these. And then a little smaller version um, pedestal. See, it's got leaves around it. Super cute. And I think I'm going to do it opposite to the opposite oh, to the, over here from the other one. Now, I have one of these, so maybe I'll put it right, you know, there.
Now, what's left to do? Got a leaf plate. This is Better Homes and Gardens, so that means I probably got this at Walmart years ago. And I think I'll put it down here. Pardon my socks and feet. Then I've got kind of cute kind of goes with the colors of the of the bookshelf and then I've got this is a candle holder am I putting a candle on it no a little garden ball and then a pumpkin. Well, my bookcase is done and I think I'm happy with it. And, you know, I didn't wanna go too crazy with stuff on it because I've got a lot going on in this room. And so, just so you know, I've got my topper, so that's blinged out. Then over here, you see, I've got the sectional, I have a vignette there and I have one there. there. Then I have my fall tree, and then I just did that too. And then if we come over here, we also have my mantle. And I've got all this to show you as well. So that's all there is to it, guys. I'm loving my little bookshelf. I'm glad I got it done. And that's it for today. So my husband and I are getting ready to go to a, a fun concert this evening. So I wanted to make sure I got something out for you uh, earlier than I normally do. So you guys have a great weekend. I'll be working on my fall home tour all weekend long. I'm not sure I'll have anything for you guys. I might. Who knows? You never know with me. So uh, anyway, that's all coming up. And uh, I'll see you guys on Monday, okay? Mwah.